in this video, I'm going to show you the pro feature of customizable pop-ups. I'm going to select a video that I want to add a pop-up to, and I'm just going to drag my pop-up onto the video. Now, if we skip the wizard, here we've created the pop-up, and you know we can change the size. Uh, we can, you know, let's just name this as demo. And, you know, we can change the color. I'm just going to keep it at white. Um, or what I'd probably want to do is maybe have it at black and change the opacity a little bit. Have it come in later on in the video. You know, so we can customize how this pop up looks. We can show the close icon so people can close the uh, close icon if they want to. Or if we want to make it that they're not allowed to close it, we can do that. Okay. And of course, you know, we can add in different elements at the top, just like what we did with the customizable interaction layers. We can add these different elements to create our pop up. But of course, as a pro user, you have the templates and the benefit of using the templates is we already have some presets over here. For example, we have an email template that's already built out, as you can see here. Okay, where we've added in, you know, the text, the email. Um, if I was using this, I would probably scroll down and I would have, uh, let's say the skip button or this, if I wanted people to be able to skip, I'd probably move that to the top and I would have, you know, what do I want it to happen on click? So when someone skips this, I want them to unpause the video so they can carry on. Um, and again, we can change all the different aspects of each element, you know, with this uh, email element here, if I wanted to change the branding. So instead of the button being green, maybe I want it to be blue. I'll make that a little bit darker. Okay. Nice and simple, nice and easy. So then, you know, if I have a video that asks for an email opt in to get a special bonus, you know, if I save this and I'm just going to preview this node with the pop up on. Hey, instead of me telling you what I think you want to know about this launch, we're going to use interact. Okay, here's where the email opt in is. And if I press skip, it is interactive video technology to let. Okay, the pop up works like a charm. Again, we've got a bunch of, uh, you know, different um, templates that you can do uh, that you can use by going on change preset. You know, we've got button templates, link templates, e-com style templates, uh, social follows, coupons, and a whole bunch. And again, just like with interaction layers, these different um, templates that we've created, we've created from scratch in the app. So you really have, uh, you know, a whole bunch of creative freedom when you're, uh, you know, creating your uh your pop-ups, you know, whichever types of pop-ups that you want to create. Okay. So again, nice and simple, nice and easy. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what type of pop-ups that you guys do create. Of course, you can create your own from scratch if you so choose to, uh, but you can use the templates that we have provided either as a place where you can get inspiration from or to be able to quickly edit if you want to offer coupons, uh, collect people's emails, offer different, uh, you know, um, pop-ups. Maybe if it's a video about clothes and you want someone to be able to select uh, the clothes that they're wearing. You know, here's an example of an econ one where we've just added in different text, different backgrounds, you know, a button and an image over here. Okay, that's how pop-ups work. That's how you can edit pop-ups. And also as a pro user, use the templates that we've created and that we keep adding into the app to make it quicker and easier for you.